Welcome back. This will be part 17 of the character rigging tutorial series. This video will talk about how to mirror the skin weights over from one side to the other. Uh, previous videos we talked about how to do the skin weights for pretty much the entire body. And at any point you can always mirror the skin weights as many times as you want. And go ahead uh, and mirror the skin weights after you do the skin weights for each individual joint. Um, so that's completely fine. Or you could wait until the end. Um, but before we do any mirror and skin weights, I always suggest to save. So save your scene out so that way you don't, uh, you know, something doesn't get messed up too much um, and you can't undo that. So this video will talk about how to mirror the skin weights over from the left side of the body to the right side because that's primarily what I've been uh, refining is the left side of the body. So my left hip is good. Uh, my right hip is not good, so I want to mirror it over from the left side to the right side. So all you have to do is have to have the body selected, and then in the skin drop down, we're going to do mirror skin weights, but go to the box beside it. Okay, so you need to tell it what right axis. So we're going to do over the YZ axis, and I know that because the X axis is perpendicular. So basically, I want to um, whatever direction the character is facing Z. Uh, we want to mirror it over the Z and Y axis there. Um, and uh, we want to make sure we understand what positive and negative is. So it's a basic cube. If I move it in the positive axis, in the translate X axis, that's this left side of the character. If I move it in the negative axis, negative 54 for the translate X, that's the right side of the character. So with my body selected, I want to make sure I go to um, the mirror skin weights options make sure I'm doing positive to negative and then do YZ let's do mirror all right so now if we go back into the skin weights there's my left hip and there's my right hip so you can see it did copy over my skin weights properly um, let's see left knee to right knee now don't just expect everything to work 100% of the time now it should but what you should do now is just make sure you go back to the right side of the body and make sure the right side has been mirrored over properly. So let's look at the spine. Yep, did a pretty good job of the spine there. Work your way up to each joint on that right side of the body and make sure it is copying everything over as you expect. Okay, if it doesn't, then you might need to go back and kind of correct some of this. Okay, so let's, let's test this out. Yep, that looks pretty good there. Test this one out, that looks pretty good there. So that way everything is working as you expect it to. Let's go test that jaw joint again. Looks pretty good from this side as well. Um, so that's an easy way to mirror over the skin weights. All you have to do is work on the skin weights for one side of the body and then mirror them over. Just make sure you have the right axis. So if your character is facing the Z axis, then you're going to choose YZ for the mirror across. And then if you paint it on the left side of the character, uh, the character's left side of his body, then you would choose positive to negative. Okay. One final thing we want to make sure we do is select uh, our root pelvis joint and go to select hierarchy and remove out any keyframes that we might have. So I have some jaw keyframes here. So we're going to select the translate, rotate, and scale attributes, oh, invisibility, and we're going to right click and choose break connections. There you go. So that way that removes any keyframes that we might have. There you go. Everything should mirror over properly. All right. So mirroring, you can do it at any stage. You can do it uh, after you uh, complete the skin weights for one joint, or you can wait until the end. Uh, make sure you save before you mirror the skin weights over. You can actually do the mirror skin weights again. So if you realize, oh, my left shoulder is not correct, you can go back, correct the left shoulder, and then re-mirror it over again. It's, it'll just override left or right side. So just be consistent. Paint the skin weights on one side of the body and mirror it over to the other side. Just make sure you're staying consistent when you're mirroring. All right, that'll wrap up this video.